hey guys what is good we are back with another video and today we're going to be playing the third episode of side chick's guide to revenge let's get into it so last episode um we sorry i was trying to recap before i started but i guess i got started blubbing on so last episode we made friends with jade and roxy we found out the truth about jade we met Nick, who is apparently Tristan's best friend and has had a crush on us. And we decided that we are going to get revenge on Tristan. Let's get into the video. Babe, you're scaring me. Just a little further. Ugh. Look at his little scum face. No peeking. You can open your eyes now. Yasmin, I know we're still young, but our five years together have been the best years of my life. Every moment feels like a dream, and nothing would make me happier than to spend the rest of my life with you. I'm so in love with you, Yasmin. Would you do me the honor of becoming my wife? No. Oh my god, Tristan. Oh yes, of course. No. I can't believe how lucky I am. Yeah, you're damn lucky, and you ruined it. So, what do we know about Tristan Lockwood? Well, we know he has a fiance and one side chick. Maybe more than one. Yes. I'm not entirely comfortable being called a side chick. We don't mean it in a bad way. Just think of it as a code name. So, I think the first plan of action should be to find out if there are any other women. It's gonna suck, but I think the best way for you to get information is if you pretend to forgive him. Act like the wedding is still on. Right. Yasmin? I know you're probably right, but the thought of having to even pretend to like him makes me want to die. We are just over Tristan. We're done with Tristan. It's fine. I'm fine. This is for the greater good. So, I guess I should go pay him a, a little visit. Mm. Mm. Here goes. We don't want him. Yasmin, you came home? Oh, look at all that fake cry. Ugh. As Tristan broke down in front of me, I was overwhelmed with the sudden urge to comfort him. All I wanted was to wrap my arms around him and tell him everything was okay, but it wasn't. He was no longer the man I fell in love with that changed the second he decided I wasn't enough for him. He lied to me, telling me he was working late when he was really out having sex with another woman. All the while, I sat home waiting for him to come home. Suddenly, the urge to comfort him turned into an overbearing urge to slap him, but I couldn't, especially not with the small audience which had gathered outside the house. All right, roll your eyes, chick, babe, I can explain. Let's talk about this inside. People are staring. Tristan let me through the house until I was, until I stood awkwardly in the middle of the living room. I had lived here for almost a year, yet I didn't know what to do with myself. The house was colder than usual and had a slightly different, sweeter smell, like a fruity perfume. I only wore floral scents. Can I get you something to drink? And he's still got women in there. I wear floral scents and it's fruity in there. I'm fine, thanks. Something to eat? No, babe, whatever you need, I'll get. Look, Tristan, you need to talk about what happened yesterday. Babe, you were never meant to see that. I never wanted to hurt you. If you give me another chance, I promise I won't do anything like that again. With this... Tristan placed his hand on my arm before yesterday. This would have been affectionate and comforting. Instead, it just stung with the reminder of his betrayal. I must have flinched because he quickly retracted it as if he was afraid of hurting me. I need to control myself. I got to. Th I've got. He's got to think I'm in love with him if I want to get anything out of him. Forgive him straight away. Make him work for it. No, we're gonna make him work for it. If we forgive him straight away, who's gonna try something? You really hurt me. I know. I re I'll regret this for the rest of my life. I love you. I understand how devastated you must be. And I promise I'll do everything in my power to fix this. 
Tristan, it's okay. What? I forgive you. I understand you have needs and you have to go elsewhere to fulfill them. Yasmin, thank you. I promise I won't let you down. God, Tristan, you stink of alcohol. It was a rough night. Excuse me. Abort mission. What's up? He's so fake. Everything coming off his mouth is bullshit. How did I never notice it before? Yasmin, you were so blind. Love does weird things to you. We don't have to do this. No, I want to. Girl, we need to do this. It's weird. This isn't the Tristan I know. It's like he changed overnight. I just miss the real Tristan, you know? He's always been like this, Yasmin. You just never noticed. He was always making comments and putting you down. And I think you just grew used to it. He promised he'd never do it again. Uh, we're not finna fall back. Come on, girl. You were stronger than that. If you want to believe him, go ahead. But deep down, you must know he's lying. Yeah, you're probably right. Just do what you need to do. We'll support you no matter what. I love you. All right, girl, get yourself together. Deep breaths. You got this. Tristan? Tristan was no longer in the room, but he left his phone on the sofa. Face down, of course. A quick look won't hurt. Did he seriously cut me out of this picture? Hey, Jafar. Yeah, I can meet you tonight. Is that good for you? Jafar. <laughs> Did I say Jafar? <laughs> I think I think it's Javier. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry, I might be tired. I'm sorry, Javier. Yasmin, are you out of the bathroom? Shit, I need to show the girls this text. Take a picture on your phone. Steal his phone. What we want to do? We can't steal his phone because then he'll notice that we stole it. So we'll take a picture. Stealing his phone is too risky. I'll just show them this picture. You okay? I made us some snacks. I thought you could fill me in on the wedding plans. Actually, something's come up, so I need to take off. But I can't wait to continue planning this wedding with you. Oh, okay. Can I kiss you before you go? Ew, no. What the fuck? Let him kiss your cheek. Yeah, we're going to let him kiss your cheek because, you know, we still got to make him think. You know, we, we want him and all that. I guess that would be okay. See you soon, babe. I love you. Ugh. It's like I'm mixing sick. The second I arrived at the apartment, I rushed into the shower, turning the heat up as high as I could handle. I felt dirty from when Tristan had hugged and kissed me. I didn't want to know where his hands had been. In an effect to block the thought from my mind, I focused on scrubbing my skin until I felt clean of his touch. 24 hours ago, I was happily engaged. It's funny how quickly everything can change. I need more ibuprofen. So, how'd it go? Mm. Uh, it was okay. It was awful. It, it was, it was, it was awful. It was awful. He was so arrogant, but I think I handled it well. He thinks the wedding's still on anyway. Did you get any information? Take a look at this. Who the hell is Javi here? I guess this is alter ego or something. I don't know. I need some air. That was weird. Roxy, are you okay? It's something bothering you. You can tell us. We've got to tell each other. We've got to tell each other things that bother us. We're a team, remember? What's wrong, girl? I think I'm one of Tristan's... Oh, my God. Side chicks. Oh, my God. This keeps getting weirder and weirder by the second. Right. 
three women? What? He cheated on me with three women? It can't be. I can't be sure. It could be another Javier or Tristan or whatever his name is. Hold on. Look familiar? <laughs> really? Cat lovers, vegans, and feminists are not welcomed. My personality is the only big thing about me. Dear God. I can't believe he went to these lengths to cheat on me. A fake name? Really? Are we going to ignore the fact that he definitely photoshopped his body here? <laughs> I know, I know. He catfished me. Cat lovers and vegan, vegans and feminists not welcomed. My personality isn't the only big thing about me. See, right? Those are the two things I noticed too. No offense, but why the hell would you swipe right on this? I wanted a challenge, okay? I was bored of all these nice guys. I wanted a bad boy. I think we all got a lot more than we bargained for. Yes, but I'm so sorry. I had no idea. It's okay, really. He should be the one apologizing, and I promise you he will be soon. Get him, girl. Get him, girl. Time to get ready to spy on Tristan. Ooh, you finna go spying. Okay. So we got on. No. Oh, I was finna say. <laughs> We're gonna wear this because this looks more spy. Plus, we ain't got time to be trying to get a skirt together. Um, fish tail, makeup, we'll go back to our, We're coming for you, Tristan. We're coming for you, Tristan. Sorry, y'all. That was like bland as I don't know what. That's our girls. That's our girls. <laughs> well, one of us needs to change. Not me. Not me. Damn it. You're so immature. Well, why should you always get the best outfits? Hello, I designed the dress. Fine. <laughs> okay. Everyone, why does she have on a dress? Why do they have on dresses and we're on a stakeout? Okay, everyone remember the plan? So, Chloe and I will watch the windows. Jada Roxy will watch the door just in case she makes a get, uh, quick getaway. And Sasha can watch from the roof. Shouldn't you be the one doing that? Doing the spying? He didn't cheat on me. Ugh. But if I see them, what if I see them doing it? You'll be fine. Yeah, I don't really seem to be nasty. Okay, I can't see much, so I need you to pay attention to the doors and windows. Tell me if you see any movement. We are on the roof, y'all. We are on the roof. What the hell are you looking at? You can just let me have this, could you? What? You always have to look better than me. I'm not trying to look better than you. Looking good just comes natural for me. Guys, can you see anything? Um, girl, too busy arguing to see anything. Hello? What is she saying? I can't hear anything over Sasha and Chloe's arguing. If you're gonna fight, can you please turn your earpieces off? Stop being selfish. This is a stakeout to get revenge on Yasmin's cheating ex. Not a fashion show, says the one wearing a tiara. I think she's leaving. Please tell me if you got eyes on the door. Is this because I called you fat in high school? What the hell? No, it's because you're always stealing my look. Since when is it a crime to have a simul to have 
a similar fashion sense. Wait, shut up. Excuse Yasmin. Justin is at the window to our left. I think he's suspicious. You need to get out of there now. She's leaving the front door. Yasmin, you need to calm down now. What? I can't understand you. Run! Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Where are we going? Well, I guess this is happening. We're jumping down. Hey! Surprise, bitch! <laughs> Don't scream. Grab her! <laughs> Who's out there? Oh, he's so dumb. Help! I've been kidnapped. Seriously, sis, calm down. We're not going to hurt you. We're just going to ask you a few questions. Are you... Are you the cops or something? What? No. Then I don't have to answer you. Are you sleeping with my fiance? What? Get mad. Be patient. Be patient. You heard me. Not that it's any of your business, but I was just leaving my boyfriend's house when you attacked me. I'm sorry, but your boyfriend is lying to you. He's also my fiance. He's cheating on both of us. And me. And me. Why should I believe you? <sighs> Here. That's us the night he proposed. Do you want to get coffee with us? We'll explain everything there. Sure. What have I got to lose? He lied about everything. Who does that? We should go confront him. Actually, that's kind of why you're, we're here. We're planning to get revenge on Tristan. I'm in. Really? Yes. I don't need to know anymore. The man will get what he deserves. Phoebe, we like you already. Okay, Jade, step forward. Ready? I'm ready, girls. What's happening? And action. Okay, we're recording. Watch your back, bitch. You've messed with the wrong women. Oh, okay, we all throwing out catchphrases and stuff. You better sleep with one eye open from now on. When you play with fire, you're going to get burned. Honey, you got a big storm coming. Hey, Tristan. Paybacks. Paybacks a bitch. Bitch. Ugh, really? Paybacks. A bitch. Bitch. Because look in our eyes. We are gonna get him. Oh alrighty guys. That was the third episode. We are ready to get started and hunt down Tristan. Oh gosh, here we go. So do you guys think the revenge is gonna work? Is he gonna learn his lesson? Or do you think he won't learn his lesson? Comment what you guys think about the story so far. I like the story, to be honest. And, um, like, subscribe, you know, all that good stuff. And, um, the description, oop, the link to the story will be in the description box down below. Um, other than that, guys, I will see you in the next video. Bye!